Matthew's Closet, Matthew's Closet, 2000 Maryland Parkway. There are many shelters that people can go to in need of food, clothing, or maybe a place just to stay warm during the cooler seasons through the year. The Las Vegas Rescue Mission is an example of one of those places where people can go to if they are in need of food or clothing. Circus Magazine went to Matthew's Closet, a place that helps the needy get clothes, and they also have a food bank. We interviewed a lady named Mary Zewin who is in charge of Matthew's Closet. Mary picks up donations too. You can donate to Matthew's Closet or they have a donation bin at Bishop Gorman High School, which is located at the intersection of Russell and Hulapai, or you can take donations to the church food bank in back of the church at 2000 Maryland Parkway. Help of Southern Nevada is where you can go to get vouchers for natural work clothes. So whenever you have clothes that need to be donated, you can give them to Matthew's Closet. They are able to accept clothing and toys that you want to donate. How many donations do you give a year? We average about 150 a week. How long has Matthew's Closet been operating? 20 years. How many homeless people do you close a year? About 150 a week. We're open from 9.15 a.m. to 11.15 a.m. on Thursdays only. What is the percentage of homeless people that come in there? 75%. Are you a nonprofit organization? Yes, everything is 100% donated. What are the qualifications on getting the clothes? They are for anybody in need. Who else do you help other than the homeless? Kids and seniors. Do you go to homeless shelters and give clothes there? No, they stay here. How did you come up with the name Matthew's Closet? The name comes from the Bible. How do you keep track of how many people go in there? We use numbers from the food bank. Have you had to turn anybody down before? We never turn anybody away for any reason, even if there is a size problem or if they are intoxicated or under the influence of drugs.